I think the CBFC is an overrated and a stupid institution. I think it has outlived its purpose uh, because what they tend to do is to think that they can actually mold how a film is made. They become filmmakers. Their job primarily is certification of films, i.e. to decide which film is suitable for which category. Even the act as it is defined is called an act for the certification of films. And only if it does not meet any of the criteria and comes into those restrictions hmm. which are there in the constitution on free speech that they are allowed to keep out a scene or the film. Otherwise they are not allowed to interfere. Art, films, literature has no impact on society. I challenge anyone to bring out one film in the last hundred years which has led to violence. None. I'll, I challenge anybody to bring out one book which has led to violence, none. What leads to violence is people picking up something and making an issue of it, not the seeing of the film. I mean, in, in, in India, PK and Haider are two recent examples of films people said would lead to huge anti-Hindu sentiment or you know, dis, uh, disappointment in the army or disillusionment in the army. I'm sorry, Haider came and went, Kashmir is carrying on, Manipur is carrying on, the army is doing what it's doing. Mm. PK came and went, the Babas are still as powerful, nothing is stopped. So films don't have an impact. We see them, we are entertained, we get something plus minus and we go. The most horrible thing he has done is to say, however, they may reject a film if for that category, right? It is found to be in violation of uh, 5B1, which is nothing but 19.2 of the constitution. The constitution is gives you right to free speech under what is called section 19.1A. Right. right? And then it has reasonable restrictions which are under 192, hmm. which say, you know, not speaking against another foreign country, defamation of, uh, in defamation, uh, contempt of court, morality, obscenity, uh, sovereignty of the state, state security of the state, and public order. Hmm. Right hmm. now, those are loose terms, right? But he has allowed them to use theirs that in defence to dismiss a film completely. Right. And his answer is, if you fall in that category, go to court. So what is the what is the sensible do now? They very easily say, sorry for you category, this film is too obscene. Right? Most people want you category. Hmm. They'll say, no, 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 for you, this is too obscene, take it back. Right. So they don't have to do the dirty work of suggesting which scenes are cut. The negotiation will then happen off screen. What do you want me to do? Cut the scene, do this scene, do this scene. So they are making the filmmaker cut the scene. Right? right. And that way the censor board will escape all responsibility. I did ask you for the cutting the scene. You come again with a second application in A category with some scenes chopped off. Okay, I'll give it to you this time. So, you know, he's basically, he's done a sloppy job.